What is the first step in the home buying process? Is it going to as many open houses as you can on a Sunday with the family? Is it going through CeeLo and searching for your dream home there? Or is it reaching out to your real estate agent and telling him or her all the specifics you want in your home? How many rooms, location, with a pool, patio? What is the first step in the home buying process? I will answer that question right now. And welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Carlos Pulido. I am a real estate agent here in South Florida. And I'm here to answer a question I get very often. What is the first step in the home buying process? Being approved for a mortgage is the first step in the process. Getting a pre-approval letter from a lender gets the ball rolling in the right direction. And here's why. First, you need to know how much you can borrow. Knowing how much home you can afford narrows down online home searching to suitable properties. So there's no time wasted looking for properties that are just not within your budget. Also, getting a pre-approval letter avoids the disappointment of falling in love with homes that are outside of your budget. Second, the loan estimate from your lender will show you how much money is required for down payment and closing costs. You might need more time to save up more money. In any case, you will have a clear picture of what is financially required. Finally, being pre-approved for a mortgage shows you and demonstrates to both your real estate agent and the person selling the home that you are a serious buyer. Most real estate agents will require a pre-approval letter before showing any homes. This is especially true at the higher level of the real estate market. Sellers of luxury real estate homes will only allow pre-screened and verified buyers to view their homes. This is meant to keep out anybody who's not ready, serious, or able to purchase the property to enter, also to protect the seller's privacy. What's more, by limiting who enters their home, sellers are given extra security from potential thieves trying to case the home, like identifying security systems, locating expensive artwork, or other high-value personal property. So there you have it. The first step in the home buying process is getting pre-approved for a mortgage, getting a pre-approval letter from your lender. If you yourself do not have a lender that you trust and that you would like to work with, just go ahead and ask your real estate agent that will go ahead and guide you through the right direction. But before you start going through CELO, before you start going to open houses, before you start telling your real estate agent about all the specifics you want in your new home, make sure that you get pre-approved. That way you know how much you get pre-approved for and you know how much home you can afford per month. Alright guys, I hope you liked and enjoyed the video. If you did, please go ahead and give a thumbs up, leave a comment, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And remember, we're here to make your real estate experience fun, easy, and exciting. See you guys on the next one.